Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. I hope you're all doing well. In today's video, I will be doing a bill exchange. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into it. I do have two $1,000 slips, four $500 slips. I have $900 in $100 bills and then I have $100 in 50s. So I have $1,000 in real money and the rest is prop money. I don't think I'll use everything, but I just wanted to make sure I had enough in case I do. So now let me get started with my first sinking funds binder. We're going to start with my daughter, Brianne. Most of it has to get exchanged because of my kids. They're the ones that have the most money. So this 500, I'm going to put to the side. And I always like to start with the smaller bills. So two three four five six seven eight nine ten i'm going to put this two to the side ten twenty thirty forty fifty sixty eighty one hundred so that's one hundred dollars there and then that's it i can't make any more change with this so we're going to keep this and I'm going to put, let me move this all the way to the back. Oh, I actually don't have enough. All right, I'm just going to leave this, the ones right there. So let me get $100 bill. So we should have $862. I'm just going to recheck it. So 500, 600, 700, 820, 40, 62. It is so much thinner now. I had so many bills in there. You're gonna see every one of my kids has a lot of bills. Okay, so now my son is the same thing, the 500 to the side. He has these 100s here. And I'm gonna start with the back. So 10, 20, 30, 40. I'm gonna put this five to the side. So that's 40, 50, 60, 80 100 and i believe yeah that's it i can't make any more change with this either so let me put this here and grab another hundred dollar bill and now he has to have 915 so 500 600 700 800 850 870 890 910 915 this binder is going to be so thin at the end. Okay, we're going to... Um, now my son Josiah, same thing. Let me put this 600 here. And I'm going to start in the back. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. That's 50, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 80, 200 and i believe let's see we're gonna be able to do another let's do these 200 first i don't know why i start at the end like that and i don't turn it over <laughs> i always do that so let me grab the 200 first so this is 800 here and we can make um i'm gonna put this 110 and i'll just grab 100 and then grab a 10, and now we're gonna have 915 as well. So 500, 600, 700, 800, 900, and 10, 15. Ooh, let me fix that. Let me go over to my son Isaiah. I haven't been counting the amount that's supposed to be in the envelope. So $1,132, let me count it. 500, 600, 700, 800, 850, 900. Let me put that one here. 900, 20, 40, 60, 80, 1,000, 1,050, 60, 70, 80, 90, 105, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32. So yeah, that's correct. I'm going to put this. This one's definitely going to need a 1K slip. So let me turn this over. Put these two to the side. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 60, 70, 80, 100. This is 100 here. 
And now, let's see. I'm gonna, I know I'm, I'm gonna, I'm kind of doing things backwards, but I just want to make sure I get it correct. Okay, so this is, we're gonna do 100 here, 200, 300, 400, 500. Okay, so I'm gonna do the 500, and then I'm gonna put this 500 back and grab a 1K slip. So that's that. And now I'm gonna grab 110 so I can grab another 100. I know I didn't have to do all that, but I was going to confuse myself if I didn't. So now he has 1,121 too. You guys look, there's literally like nothing here. So obviously this is going to represent that I have, I will have $1,000 in the bank for him. There's already 500 but I'll just add an additional 500 to that. So you know what, this here, I'm gonna put it to the side just to make sure that I remember that. The fact that there's only 500 in real money and the 500 was already in the bank for my son, my oldest son. All right, so now for back to school, let's start with the smaller bills. We can't do that, nothing there. So let me grab a 10, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. There's so much money. I'm like confused. <laughs> all right, so that's all we can do here. So we have 100. You know what? Should I do a 50? No, I'm going to keep some 20s in here. So we have 100, 120, 140, 160, 170, 1, 2, 3. 100. You know what? I keep, I keep changing my mind, but it's all right. I'm kind of winging this video. All right, so we have the 173. Clothing, clothing should have 207, so it has 50, 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, and 5, 6, 7. So I, for this, I will keep a few, um, I will keep some change. Let me see. <laughs> Let me just grab 100 and... We're gonna leave it like that. So 100, 120, 140, 160, 180, 200, and 567. Yeah, because um, I just want some change in some envelopes just in case. Activities has 120, 40, 55. Um, I'm gonna change this. Grab a 50. Okay. These videos take so much concentration just because you don't want to shortchange your envelopes and then have to look for the mistake later on. So for health, I should have 280, so that's 100, 200, 220, 240, 260, 270, 275, 280. So all we could do is the 20s. So we have a 280. Okay, so we have 280. We're good there. I don't have like super thick envelopes in every single category, especially this binder. This one's like super thin, but I I needed it. It was too much of like little small bills. So I can't do anything with these $4 bills and I technically can't do anything at all with family fun. I was debating whether to do my cash stuffing before I did the bill swap, but I just opted for the bill swap first. I could have probably had even more change, but it's all right. <laughs> so we can't do anything here either. For birthdays, we can't do anything. I'm starting to think that this bill swap was not needed very much. Okay, so we can only do 10 here. So now we have 120, 30, 5, 6. Holidays, I don't think I could do anything. No, there's only a 10 and a 5. And then for dates, 
I have 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45. So I can do a $20 bill. And shopping has $1. <laughs> and then my envelope, I think I'm actually going to change it for smaller bills because. So let me change the singles though. One, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna grab a five. And I have, oh, I have another single. So I have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, and 20s. I am trying to save a little bit of money to be able to trans transfer this over to my personal sinking funds binder, which is another binder. If you see any of my other videos, Actually, my YouTube stuffing video, I'll leave it linked here. I have a personal binder and I have a, quite a bit of envelopes in that binder. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a 20 and then change it for one, two, three, four. And I think we're good there. I just want to be able to distribute a little bit of money throughout the envelopes. So I need um, smaller denomination. So that's 20, 40, 60, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, and 5, 6, 7. I know that was this. <laughs> Usually these bill swaps you have to exchange for bigger bills. But only for this one I'm choosing to do smaller bills. So now we're going to go over to my second sinking funds binder. And this one's like the super, super skinny one. Um, but I think we do still need to change some envelopes. Okay, so I'm going to do a 50. So we have 55. Home repairs. This is ugh, so annoying that it does that. Okay, so home repairs has... Should have 273, 100, 150, 170, 190, 210, 230, 250, 260, 265, 270, 271, 172, 73. All right, so obviously we can't do anything with the $3 bills. We have 5, 10, 20, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. There's so many 20s and 5s. Okay, so. Let me grab the 100, and now that's it. That's all we could do. So we have 1, 200, 250, 270, 71, 72, 73. Home decor should have, let's see, 78. Now it has 50, 70. Now <laughs> it has the 50, 70, 75, 76, 77, 78. I can't do anything there. Room remodel, there's nothing in there. And actually, make sure to watch my next cash stuffing because I have pretty exciting news when it comes to my um, Ashley's Furniture credit card. So stay tuned for that. Utilities. I don't think I could change anything. No, I have 62. Car maintenance. Let's see, I'm gonna put this 500 to the side. Let's, we can't do anything with these $4 bills. So we have 10, 20, 30, 40, 60, 80, 100. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 100, okay. I haven't been recounting to make sure that I'm getting the right amount. Hopefully I don't mess up. I'll go, I'll rewatch the video when I edit. So now I have 500, 600, 620, 640, 660, 661, 62, 63, 64. This binder is going to be so much thinner now, even more. Annual bills. Let's see. I can only do a 10. Now I have one, 150, 160, 165, 66. This is going to be a pretty short bill exchange, guys. I think next time I'm going to wait till I have way more bills. 
and rollover i don't think i could change anything no i only have nine dollars all right well that was kind of quick quick for me because i usually <laughs> do way longer videos Alrighty, so let me put this here and now oh let me move that there now i'm gonna grab all of the money and we're gonna count it i'm not gonna count the prop money i guess i didn't need i didn't even need let me put these to the side because i didn't end up needing any of these and then well i'll put this one to the side as well so i only needed the one case slip and then this is already reflecting it's in the bank so let's see i'm gonna put it here that's to represent the 500 that my son already has in the bank it's pretty thick guys i mean it's not super thick but <laughs> i think it's still pretty satisfying all right i'm gonna put the smaller bills at the bottom and then we're gonna start counting the larger bills first i always count the larger bills first which ones do you guys count first all right so let me start with i'm just gonna grab a pile and of course i'm gonna use my calculator because i can't count to save my life <laughs> without it okay so we have 100 200 50 100 50 200 50 250 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60, 80, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, plus 500, 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 200, plus 200 I don't even know why I'm doing these piles like this but <laughs> bear with me let me move this out of the way and move that too <laughs> okay so 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 110 20 30 plus 130 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 100, plus 100. I'm trying so hard not to mess up. <laughs> I've had to pause a couple of times. All right, so 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, Ooh. plus 100. So far we have 1480 and we're almost there. Let me grab this right here. So 5, 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, plus 35. So we have $1,515 to take back to the bank. You guys, that is so much money. I'm so glad I'm not going to have all of these small denominations anymore. I just want to put it like this so you guys can see. <laughs> it looks so cool i never have so much money like spread out like this but anyway so yeah like i said this is the 500 so technically it would be what one thousand two thousand fifteen dollars but the 500 was prop money but yeah guys we have one thousand five hundred and fifteen dollars this money will go back to the bank and i hope it was satisfying for you guys to see it wasn't as much money as i thought it was going to be but look like well this one was the skinny one this one of them and then this one was super thick it was like it was like this at one point so eventually i am i actually already have a new binder but i'm trying to build up if i'm gonna change um envelopes or whatever so i'm not even gonna show it right now because i do want to split this one up into two binders since i have like a bajillion envelopes in this one that's why it's so thick but anyway uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. 
I really wanted it to be a lot more money, but it's it's a pretty decent amount. I have a lot in 20s and a lot in 5s. And I feel like my own personal ATM at the moment. But yeah, I, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give this video a like. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. And as always, I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day or night. See you next time. Bye.